Welcome back to Metroid Prime 2 Echoes! Got some fun stuff happening today. A lot of fun stuff. You gave me the vibe of like a 90s cartoon where it was just guitar riffs all over the place. <laughs> I, I kind of want to hear that for Metroid Prime 2. Every time we intro, intro it's just like... Welcome so back to Metroid Prime 2! Oh yeah! <laughs> or maybe I just got the riff of SWAT cats stuck in my head, but I kind of want to see that for Metroid Prime 2. You see, SWAT cats needed an entire gunship and two people to, to save the day. <laughs> Samus only needs herself. Samus took the gunship and put it on her body, and there we go. She is holding- She absorbed it. She got gunship power. <laughs> she got, you got the gunship suit. I am a gunship! So, uh, from the last boss in the last episode, we still kind of technically hadn't gotten our reward yet. You've been... You've mentioned that, and I can only imagine, because you wanted me to guess what we're actually going to get. I couldn't guess the Echo Visor, because I didn't actually think we'd be getting a visor this late into the game. So now you got me curious. So we're getting... we're gonna get a new toy today to start things out. I like getting a new toy. We're basically doing the last bit that we need, because in the next episode, we're gonna be taking on the boss. Ooh. So we gotta do everything else that we can before then. It involves going in that portal there. Okay. So, am I allowed to ask, can we do like a 20Q when trying to figure out what this new special item is? Well, uh, I won't let you guess too much, but I'll, uh, I'll try and ask what's pertinent. How about three? Okay. Uh, I got three questions. Okay, three questions. Go for it. Have we had this in a Metroid game before? Yes. Okay. Uh, is it... Hmm... Does it have to do with our missiles? No. Does it have to do with the visor? No. That's three. Okay. So... So this isn't like some brand new item that only appears in Metroid Prime 2. But it's still good to get this late in the game. Oh, yes. Which is why I'm very curious about it. Because I like getting new toys. Alright, we gotta go down here now. Especially here in Metroid. All the toys. Leads to a bomb slot. And open up the portal. Sweet. There we go. Alright. So what could it be? So that means... It could only be a beam. But we've got light and dark, and we're not getting like anything new like plasma or ice or anything like that. We we still have new beams to get though. I mean our our arsenal isn't complete yet. Okay, okay. Still many things that we can that, that we still yet to get. Maybe we'll get a a power power bomb or it drops two bombs at the same time for utter arm again. An ultra bomb! Ultra bomb! Adam Malkovich is like that's really not allowed. <laughs> Well, guess what I think of that? <laughs> Two explosions. Right. I, I, it's, it's ridiculous that this is the only, that in the dark world is the only place where you have crates like this. There's our second key, by the way. Oh, perfect. It's going to be a long time before we get that, though. Damn it. Okay, well, never mind. It's, kind of, it's a little bit out of the way, in a sense. You know what theme actually pops into my head when we were looking at that big wall of spider track and everything. What's that? So, you play Bomberman 64, right? Of course. The end level, that, like, metropolis kind of area, but with a lot of cars and everything, very mechanical. Yeah. That theme kicked into my head for some reason. Maybe it's just because all the mechanized structures... Maybe I just missed Bomberman 64. I never got that far in that game. I only got I, to the first I, level and couldn't get past it. I yeah, couldn't figure out I what got, to do. I got to the first level in there and, and it just got too big and too long and too hard. Now it's like, okay, I think my time with Bomberman 64 is done. Let's move on to Bomberman Hero. God, that just takes me back to where I had so much free time. I was actually getting all the the chips, all the gold chips or whatever gold, it was. Gold cards, yeah. Gold cards, excuse me. Yeah, I had all the time in the world to figure out how to hurt the bosses in the way to get the gold cards and able to find all the hidden extras. There's the room where we get our new item. <sighs> Give me that new item. Give me that plasma beam. Probably not. Can you see it right there? Yeah, we've there used the plasma is. before. The glitch beam. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah, stop hey, we're that. Good. We're good. We're good. Oh, I really hope it's a beam that just dismantles those things with one shot. It is. What? Oh my god. Hello, beautiful. Any idea what it is? Is is that the screw attack? Well, we, we still got a long way before we get it though, because we, we can hit this bomb slot and that shoots four <laughs> beams in opposite directions. Ah, dead. But we got to turn them all the way around, and to uh, do that, okay. we have to go back to another portal. 
Wait, seriously? Yep, we gotta lower this bridge, basically locking us in here. If they're making you work this hard for your specialty item, it better be damn good. It better be damn good. Is it damn good? It better be damn good. Okay, with that intonation, it could go either way. So it is damn good. It better be damn, <laughs> damn good. It better be worth my goddamn time. Oh, we'll see if it is. Especially all the roundabout things that are making us do. Exactly. I'm just thinking, is like, why do we have to go through all these hoops? Any particular reason? Because it's damn good! Uh, okay. Th there we go. That's the intonation I was looking for. It's damn good. Oh, there we go. I thought there was actually a door behind that portal. I was just thinking, how on earth do you get that? Well, I guess don't scan it, but kind of defeats the purpose. So here, there are four, like, spinners, I suppose, in this room here. Okay. Now that we're outside of it. Ah, uh, yes. And we gotta go up these platforms in order to get there. The thing is, though, when we get up here, there are resbits here to welcome us. Hello. Uh, I would like to glitch your system. It sounds fun. And this is where my two super missiles gets put to the test. You're actually kind of low on missiles. I, I am, so what I've also found that uh, spamming power beam kind of works a bit too. Again, I could use a charged uh, dark beam and the one missile, but this far away, they will dodge it immediately. Understandable. So it's, and uh, th there's like four of them in this room, so. That's, that strategy is more for like close quarters. Yeah. I totally understand that. In, in a situation where we couldn't possibly miss. There's another one. He's gonna put oh. up his shield. He likes to put up his shield right when my missile gets close enough to hit him. You know what? I was just thinking, is that timed perfectly? Of course it is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was a nope. I could actually. No, uh. I could actually see the glitchy hand just go, nope. No, uh, damage. No. -uh. It's like, well, you thought you were locked on, but uh, we made it so you're not locked on, so you weren't locked hey, on, hey, and hey, now you what? get to eat shit. Nuh uh. Nuh uh. Mm -mm. And second one over here. How am I having, like, Oop. nostalgia thoughts for a game I never played? What game? Because I've had that too. Well, this one. Like, I'm taking a look at this and I'm like, man, GameCube era kind of rocked and I wish I was back there. I remember using my birthday money to get Super Mario Sunshine. Because I just got a GameCube. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, it, it formed me into where I am today. <laughs> you know, I, I'm, I'm kind of glad that I li I've lived long enough that people have turned on Super Mario Six on Super Mario Sunshine. Aw, but I think it's good. I oh, know. turned on it. I know. Okay. See, it used to be people thought, well, it, it's the Ma black Mario's, Mario's got this stupid water thing on his back, and it's it's different and bad and dumb. Mario Sunshine is a crap game. It was always crap. But yeah. I think now, ever since Galaxy, that kind of gave people what they wanted. The, the marketing that they actually wanted all along. I think people are looking back on Sunshine with a lot more fondness. And yeah, it's, it, I mean, I liked it from the start. It's always been a black sheep game. Especially when you're going for 100%, then it's just a nightmare. <laughs> but, you know, you, you get through it, you push those feelings down, and then you're just like, okay, yeah, we got 100%, we got all the stupid blue coins, give me my 20 Shine Sprites. There is a place in my heart for Mario Sunshine. Absolutely. Maybe not a big place, but a place. Oh, uh, I just flash back to playing through Wind Waker twice because I wanted to be in my pajamas when I fought Ganon. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's great. Okay, but what's that have to do with the game? Oh! oh! Oh, you mean Link in his pajamas. I thought... <laughs> Ganon's pajamas. Hell I, yeah. I, I thought you were in your pajamas oh, when no. you people. <laughs> also, the second time through, you can actually read the Hylian, which was a nice little unlock. Yeah. I like how the first thing when you're hearing that is like, oh, you don't understand? Well, then I'll just use English. <laughs> right, we unlocked the spinners, but we gotta go back the way we came now. Okay. Probably have to activate a thing in the dark. We, we gotta um, activate the bomb. Thing. We gotta yeah. activate the bomb slot, basically, so just, okay. we're just literally so, making our way back. Just gotta jump on through. And just, but it's worth it, I swear, it's yeah, damn just, good. Just keep, just keep on rolling. Yeah, here we go. Straight through I the I know portal it's gonna again? take 10 minutes for us to get, but it's gonna be worth hey, it. Trust me, okay. believe me, trust me. I have a specific amount of trust that I have allocated specifically for the Let's Plays you have me participate in, which means I have quite a bit of trust in you. I'm, I'm not bad most of the time. Well, I never said you were bad. I said I trust you completely, basically, because I don't know what these games are. They're Metroid games. 
Well, I mean, besides being I know, I know. I'm just giving you a hard time because it's fun. <laughs> Actually, I do kind of love the dynamics. It's like, I know nothing about this game. Show me all the cool stuff. All right. Here we go. Where they finally throw you a bone. And they give you something really nice. Something that's worth the headache it took to get it. And it even takes you right up to it. The sunbeam. The super beam. The... Yeah, that's... Is that actually the screw attack? Or at least the space jump? We already got the space jump. Oh shit, we did. But now we got the screw attack! Yes! Oh, that's good. They added the screw attack in this game. The screw attack works a little differently than it may have in previous games. Okay, let's see you, it. You, ju you get five jumps, double jump, and then one, two, three, four, five. Oh, they, they limit it. Okay, okay. That's so you don't, like, go sailing across yeah, the map. Right, yeah, go, go uh, unlimited so power. You still here. got a little bit of challenging gameplay. One, One two, two, three, four, four five. five. Yeah. yeah, just made it. Ooh, that's good. Does it have power? Oh, it has power. Oh, it has power. Oh, the power this power has. Hey, there are some guys. Should we test out the power? I mean, I could test out the power, but they're too far away. I'm just going to super missile them because I don't <laughs> super care. Super missile them right in the goddamn face. Well, maybe just one super missile because I'm saving missiles. I'm a little... A little uh, dry right now. You're in the double digits. You're running low on missiles. Y y yes, I am. That's only eight <laughs> super missiles. Oh, yeah, you're right. Or four res bits. <laughs> I'm now counting in res bits. And there's a lot of mechs here that really need a lot of super missiles here. I understand. All right, so let's wreck the dark world with our new screw attack. Yep, diving back in. We just got one quick thing to get here. Because in addition to the super- to the screw attack, we can also climb these specific walls. Oh, okay, well these guys first decided to come back. Oh, no. I'm so glad I found that. I'm so, I'm so glad I learned that just one charge uh, being one missile takes care of everything. No. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, these walls right here. Are actually wall jump no surfaces. No way. A wall jump this far in? It takes a little bit getting used to, but essentially you screw attack into him, and you gotta like push the control stick towards the wall, oh. and then use that to jump towards the other wall. It's a little confusing, okay, but uh, this, is, this is a great way to get used to it, and there's a couple more instances too. I, I see that. It, it looks complicated, but when you like figure out how to do it, it's like, oh, okay, I got it. Once you get it, you'll have no problem doing yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. It's just figuring out what the game wants from you, and really where the camera is going to end up, so you know where to turn the control stick. Okay. It kind of kind of depends on you, like predicting <laughs> where the camera is going to go, so you can point the control stick in that direction preemptively. It seems doable. I mean, we've we've had jank before in Metroid Prime with, yeah, surprisingly the screw attack as well, where you could do it so many times. Oh my god. You're okay. There. All right. We're good. You're okay. You're okay. Jesus. She fell off. We got her. <laughs> what do you mean she teleported? Blah! All right. Now we got to backtrack a bit of ways. Does it automatically go into screw attack after you try a third jump? Yes. Do a third jump. You go into a uh, screw attack. So one, two, and then Three, screw attack four, just like that. Five. Okay. So you can. That doesn't seem too bad. And I, I thought it would be jarring going from first to third. It's actually not too bad. It's just like going from Morph Ball. Right. Very natural, very clean. Uh, it's oh, kind of hard to go. do in uh, closed quarters like this, though. Now, I have a question about the screw attack. Uh-huh. I know it's all-powerful. Yes. Does it kill Resbits? Yes. <laughs> in one <laughs> hit. <laughs> 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 That's why there was four of them guarding it. Oh, that makes so much sense. It's the Resbit's last uh, desperate claw oh, before make... you have the bane of their existence. That makes so much sense. I'm glad they did that. Nice attention to detail. Good design, good design. Oh, well, now that we have the power to stop the glitching, what do we do now? We're cutting our way back to main research, which was where the, that big dome where the drone was, oh, that okay. last boss we fought. Gotta head back there. There's something a little extra we can get there with the screw attack now. 
I like extra secrets. I do too. You can do this too. Uh, ooh. How much damage would you say it does the screw attack do in comparison to like say a missile or something like that? Probably about 10 then if that's the case. Jesus. Because of two super missiles can kill a resbit. To kill a resbit, that's 10 missiles. I would say that it's the equivalent of 10 missiles then. <laughs> Let's test it out. <laughs> oh, well, we'll have our shot. Right now, we just got to get to where we need to go. All right, you live to see another day, Resbit. Right now, we're going to get that second temple key. Oh, oh perfect. Here we go, here we go. Boom! Boom. <laughs> oh, it's outstanding. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. God, you love to see it. Oh, I do love to see it. Oh, hey. I completely forgot there was a power bomb door over there. Are you saying there's something else we can get in here? Yeah, we're not going there yet. There's some resbits around here. What if I can... Oh, there, there, there they are. We'll deal with them later. Ow. Ow. <laughs> not what's important. We're just we're just getting the, the, the second temple key here. That one kind of, like, pushed you in the portal. It's just, it's like, it didn't want to it's fight. Right, it was just get like, in there. get, get out of here. I just want to push you into the dark world so dark resbits can deal with you. All right. So there's one door out of here, really. Ow. Got some huntering making it difficult for us. I'd like to ignore them. Ah, screw attack walls. Yes, this is probably the best way to practice first off. Oh, you can actually like cling to the wall a little bit. Yep, a little bit of sliding. It's it's a little bit getting used to, but they're okay. not like... Okay, that actually makes it a lot easier. He's got to do the Hayabusa, basically. Oh my god, you're pulling a dread. Maybe a, just a little bit. And there. Stuck the landing. Make sure you don't go too high, otherwise you will hit the top of the... You hit the top of the room and then <laughs> stun lock all the way down. Don't! That was an embarrassing practice session. <laughs> so is that what you're doing? You're doing a practice run and then the, the real run? Yes. Oh, hello, beautiful. And there we go. It's two of three Dark Temple Keys. Making progress, making progress, yeah. Additional download into the inventory screen. Now, since we haven't seen the third one, is it a place we haven't been yet or a place we have been yet? It's essentially kind of in a new area and it'll be close to the end of uh, of this level, per se. Okay. So it's essentially go get the third key and then go fight the boss. Cool. But we're not going to do that yet. There's still quite a few expansions that we can probably pick up on the way. And, well, really, it's going to take a long time for us to get, get that third key, go to the boss, fight the boss, get the energy controller, make it all the way back to Yumo, da -de da all that. So let's get some expansions and do some backtracking. So we're gonna make a big old loop. We're gonna uh, hit, we're gonna hit up Torvus Bog and Aegon Wastes and make it back to Sanctuary Fortress in the time we have left. That's fantastic. So going through this power uh, power bomb door here. This is what's gonna take us to Torvus Bog. <laughs> you set the kernels on fire. You're never gonna get good popcorn. Oh, I think I'm going to get pretty good popcorn. Oh, there they go, there they go. There we go. <laughs> this is also good because uh, the, the path we're taking to get these expansions, uh, we're going to get a refill on missiles pretty good. Ooh. Are we visiting the ship? Well, no, probably not. Things are going to seem familiar. Off to Torvus Bog. God, I'd love that we have the screw attack now. Oh, it is nice. Oh, it that's is very so nice. cool. We're uh, in the underwater section. Por qué? Yeah. Oh. Well, isn't that neat? Is the only way you could get it. Oh, okay. Oh, it's not that deep. Could have got. We could have got here from uh, this portion right here. I see, I see. Uh -huh. Oh, I, I recognize where we are. Yeah, now okay, you know where okay. we are. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now you'll know what I mean when I say we have to go to where the power bomb guardian was. I see what you're saying. I like what you're saying. These guys are stingy. They don't ever give me anything. Well, yeah, you're killing their colony. I've been here like three times. They never give me any items. They're very stingy. Do not trust them. Just destroy them. They will not help you with your missiles or your beams. They will only help in making you sad. Who can help you are these guys. Oh my god. Oh these my guys god. are very generous. They are my friends. They will give you power bombs. They will give you missiles. They will oh. give you health. 
They'll even give you a happy ending if you want that. <laughs> if you're into that. If, you, if you're into that. I'm not. I don't need it right now. I mean, this is a happy ending. This is a happy enough ending as it is. But just I mean, look. <laughs> we're back to three digits on our missiles. Oh, yeah. We got 16 super missiles now. That's some good stuff. Well, we, way more than that. We got like 32 super missiles now. Sitting pretty. Hell yeah. So I know it probably doesn't do anything, but if shooting a Dark World portal with a light beam, is that basically like crossing the streams from Ghostbusters? I don't think it does anything. I, I know. It, it just kind of dissipates it, it just, I suppose. It just sounds kind of funny. It's like, don't shoot it with the wrong color, otherwise your, all your atoms will disintegrate. Nah, I don't think we gotta worry about that. <sighs> hmm. So I, now essentially... Oh god, not these guys again. Ow. Wait, does screw attack work? Yeah, I haven't tried it. Ooh, I wonder if screw that attack would, That would be a good thing to try, though. That would be so cool if screw attack worked. It would be. <laughs> Too bad I didn't think of it. Uh, it's okay. Something for later. Because I'm, I'm thinking, well, what's the point? Because they're just going to go, nuh uh, when I get close enough. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, she's close. I'm going to go invisible now. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you go to screw attack for them and they just go, tink. No. No, none of that. Yeah, I can't tell if you're doing damage or not. Oh, that there, did it. There we go. All right. So in the opposite room here, we got more of those walls. I didn't even see these the first time we were here. You, did, you weren't even looking for them. You didn't even think about them. Then how did you know they were here? Because I'm cheating! <laughs> damn it! <laughs> there. there we go. Ah, uh, oh, oh. oh, damn it. Again, a little jank, but I'm glad they're not asking me to do, like... Everything under the sun when, with these things. Advanced yes. screw attack jumping. Hey, nice missile tank, man. Not bad for a missile tank, though. I'll take yeah. it. Alright. We got one more thing to get here in Torvis. Is it through the portal? Uh, well, we gotta go through the portal to get back. Hmm. But you say there's something else we can get. What do you mean, sir? This one's, this one's gonna be a fun one, but we gotta go a little bit of ways to get there. I'm down for the adventure. We, uh, we, we gotta get out of this uh, underwater area, and we gotta get out of the Dark World, of course. And there is no easier way to get up from here, aside from going from the spider balls <laughs> all the way around here. I should have gone the other way, really, but that's okay. Da, 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 da. Ba, ba, you ba, get ba, to live and learn. To go up this section of track right here. Okay. Sheesh. That's the only way back, it seems. Well... Give and take. Give and take. Oh, that was a weird transition. <laughs> One singular screw attack. Just a small screw. There we go. It's essentially a triple jump, it feels like. I wish it would... I know why it doesn't do it, because every other screw attack mixed with a space jump does the exact same thing. But you notice how you go forward when doing a screw attack. You don't ever go up anymore. You're also locked into an axis. Oh, more of these guys. If oh, need, yeah. If you still need more beam ammo. I guess I never noticed that. Yeah, you are locked in the uh, in the x-axis. So it's limited somewhat, so that way you're not just, you know, just flying around like a, like a crazy... <laughs> Everything will die! Ah! <laughs> I'm a windmill of death! <laughs> yeah, we're max missiles back up. Oh my god, look at all the power! All the power! We're doing great. Who needs a missile door? A missile recharge, there we go. All right, let's get out of here. I actually forgot you were in water. You're just going about your day. Just having a great time. Remember the first time we came here? Oh, I hated it. I could barely do anything. It wasn't fun. I mean, it was fun to talk through, but yeah, I can see. Yeah, that was that, that was the most uh that was the most difficult part with the alpha blog and everything and getting sensory deprivation. <sighs> that that was that was rough. That's probably the roughest part of the game, I'd, I'd argue. It's just like sitting there in water and just going, Yep, I'm definitely going slow. Everything's slow, everything's murky, things won't get hurt when you kill them. It's, 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 it's a mess. Alright. Gotta go through here. Ooh. Gotta go to the room that has the portal. All this... Back and forth, back and forth with all of this. God, I I, I kind of love that you're doing, you know, you're, we're doing backtracking, but you're kind of chopping it up into different segments. The Let's Play I watched a million years ago was like, okay, we're getting all the backtracking stuff in one video. An hour and a half later, it's like, oh, God. 
Well, the guide I'm using, it says, okay, now that you got this item, you can now go all the way to this place and get that item. I'm thinking, well, that's kind of kill the flow, so I'll go there later. I'll go there Which, later, which we'll yeah. have to. Yeah. Usually to get a, a uh, some other optional item or whatever. You see that platform back there? Yep. It's gonna oh, be a little tricky to land and there. And go! Don't where you find out that screw tag is not exactly the most accurate of, uh, of movements, especially, hey, uh, well. it's fun. It's very fun, and I'm glad it only takes away 10 health. So you just gotta kind of land on it, just like that. Woo! Ooh, and it's all worth it for another E-Tank. Actually, yeah. Legitimately worth it. All right. That fully healed you, too. I can't believe it. Now we gotta go to Aegon. Oh. All right. Well, bye, Torvus. It was fun thanks, to join you thanks, for... Torvus, I think you got like a few more things left for us, but that's going to be for later. That's for future Samus. Anything that we that we miss, we'll probably get back when we have to do the uh, Sky Temple keys. We got to go everywhere to get that. You know, it feels like we've been in the Sky Fortress for like a million years, but I know we haven't. Well, it's because we keep having to leave and come back. <laughs> exactly. We're coming and going all the time. We're getting one new thing and going out and checking all the other things. And every time we leave and come back, we come back feeling that much more capable. Exactly. <laughs> and yet we've only had two keys. Find the third one eventually. There we go. But it just, it's just funny though. You know, we left, we came back, we got one key, he left, came back, and said, oh, hi, Dark Samus, leave, come back. And it's just like, oh, okay, here, there's another key for you. Because we're a woman on a mission. A We've mission. got the drive. A mission to get all the collectibles. It's about drive. It's about power. We stay hungry. We devour. All right, all right. we're we're here at Aegon. We got two more things to get here too. Mm, time for a new beam upgrade. I'm kidding. We're not getting a beam upgrade. No, it's mostly expansions. We 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 got the screw attack. I think that's going to be good for a we while. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you saying the screw attack is the end all? Uh, yes, actually, that is what I'm saying. The infinite? Hello? Well, oh, it's a, we well, it's a reason why the Aang kept that under lock and key so good. Well, you're saying we can't possess the screw attack? What, what do you mean we can't possess the screw attack? I think for the first time, like, since we got the screw attack here, I think for the first time, the Aang, collectively everywhere, said, Shit. I would think so, too, We yeah. have Sonic Locks here. Ah. Ah. Uh, I see. Uh -huh. I see. More like you hear. I hear the echoes. I'm wishing. I'm wishing. Today. Today. you find me. you find me. I hate that one. All right, fine. Like, I'm not talking to you anymore. Like, I love the, the the crack behind Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, but I hate that fucking movie. You just unlocked a... a <laughs> to a another E-Tank. Oh, my God, a new E-Tank. But we need a screw attack for it. Well, shit, we better go get the screw attack. Oh, oh wait. wait a minute. Check oh, that out. Hey. That's pretty awesome. That's nice routing. It's taking a little. It's, it's, it's gonna take a little bit to get in here. It might take a couple tries because you gotta be like right on it, essentially. It's also a timed puzzle. Okay. Surprise! Yep. Uh, oh, nope, 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 yep. nope. Oh, plinking right off of it. Ah, uh, donked. Even Samus looks like she's pissed off at that. She's just, just like, oh, oh come my on. Head. Oh. <laughs> that one didn't even get a full turn. And. and Oh, I think that's it. That's it. That's it! Got it! Yeah! Whoa! Woo. Nice backflip there! Alright. This next one's pretty easy. Samus Aaron the Acrobat. And we gotta head to the temple. We're just hitting all the... We're, we're wait basically a, wait a minute. Yeah! Showing off the, the best of all the places. A tour guide through all the different places that the Luminoth called home. Putting the elevators in between the specific levels is just the best part. Like, I love I don't have to go to the temple grounds and then go back through here. There's actually a route that I can go to make things go faster. That's so nice. It's, it, it, it is. The Luminoth having the foresight of going, oh, this is annoying. Hey, let's build another elevator. What do you think? You guys okay with that? Oh, that guy got lucky. Uh, I, yeah, I that wanted guy got him lucky. to drive right into you. 
He had enough self-preservation not to go any higher. You probably felt the heat off of the screw attack. You see how burning hot you're looking? <laughs> yeah. It's just like, whoa! Whoa! That just set off the thermometer. Woo! It's still burning. Ah, 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 ah. My, my neck hair, it's all gone. My hair hair is gone, jeez. All right, here we go. And, it, oh, I thought we were actually aiming for the cannon. And got it. Perfect. Now what? Power bomb. Oh. Uh, gotta oh. get okay, power bomb yeah. for a power bomb, right? I was hoping it was gonna do an animation like that. Wow. Oh, they're not gonna need it. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Ah, another power bomb. Yeah, it's good that we get them when we're kind of not really needing them anymore. It's, it's fine. I'd go. I'd go back. Don't go forward when you get this because the ledge is higher. And you will fall to your death. So you have to take the cannon. <laughs> yes. Is what I'm hearing. Oh, what's up, guys? Not too bad. And now we're done. Just gotta find a sweet save point and make it back to... Just gotta find a way back Ow. to Sanctuary Fortress. If only there was a way around here. If only there were a way back to Sanctuary Fortress. If only it wasn't like one room away. Oh, oh wait, my here God. we go. Oh my god, the routing on this guy? Man, I love how that looped together so well. Just like, wait, can I make this work? I can make this- I can make this work! Oh god, yes! <laughs> oh, so not only did you get ultimate power, you got the satisfaction that you made a route work. Ultimate efficiency! Yeah, That's really- that's really- it's just- just when, when everything goes well and just so efficient. That's nice. Basically just get to hug yourself for the day. It's just like, eee, I did it! Just the satisfaction of pieces falling into line. Oh god, I feel kind of extra powerful now. When you take a piece of paper and you fold it and the edges just line up properly, just... Mm. First time. First time. Without even looking. Oh god, I just noticed we only have one more E-Tank to get. We do. That is sexy. Yeah, uh, we only have one more E-Tank. Uh, which... Which missile expansion was that? That was four. That, we, I think we only got four missiles left. Oh shit! We're coming up to the end so quickly. Yeah. Oh no. And that was the what was it? fifth power bomb. I think we only have three left of those too. I love it. It's and all coming together. We only have one beam expansion left. Oh right, 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 right. I completely forgot about that. It's just, it's just like who needs light and dark? I've got screw attack here. So yeah, we're we're kind of nearing the end here. Not much, not much more left to the game. I can't wait until we do another recording session and you're like, oh, by the way, it's the end. <laughs> what? Probably not going to be that abrupt, uh, but I think it would no. be kind of funny. I, I think we got at least, a, you know, two, three weeks more left. Okay. Because we still got to beat the boss, we still got to get the Sky Temple keys, we still got to right. do the last bit of the area, we got to do the multiplayer. Got to beat Dark Samus. Got to beat Dark Samus, you know, there's, st well, there's, st there's still plenty to go. But uh, next time... On Metroid Prime 2 Echoes, we are certainly, indeed, going to be clearing the last temple and restoring all of the energy back to regular ether. And then we'll have the enemy on the run, and we can finally take them down. Ah, oh, it's gonna feel so good. Ah, uh, it's all—it's all gearing up. It's all gonna be—it's all gonna be worth it. I'm excited. We'll see you next time.